Am I ready? Any time. Gotcha. The next fight has been arranged. You don't have a lot of time, so I'll just tell you what you need to know. The ninth ranked assassin is currently Dr. Peace. A doctor? Actually, a detective. A dirty and unscrupulous detective with plenty of dark secrets about him. Illegal investigations, illicit sales, black marketing. He is your one-stop shop for marketing illegal goods. And on top of that, he is a trained assassin. He's been doing some work for the Mafia. And before you know it, he's up there ranked ninth on the list. To be frank, he's good. You won't stand a chance against him. You're as good as dead. What's it going to be, cowboy? Put me in, coach. All right. Please transfer 150,000 LB dollars. What? 150,000 LBs? Your entry fee? My overhead costs? Don't tell me that you were not expecting so many zeros on that price or that I am ripping you off or some shit. We have an elite staff in the thousands. Personally, I think it's a bargain. Okay, I gotcha. But you really think I got that kind of dough on me? What the hell am I supposed to do? You are supposed to do your job. You've been hired to kill someone, so just do it and quit your whining. Plus, on-the-job training would be good for you. If you're interested, I can introduce you to an agent, an advertisement agency. But really, they're erasers. I'll tell you where it is later. I'm running late for my facial. Catch up later, okay? What? No! Hey, Travis, the next fight has been prepared. Destroy Stadium. Dr. Peace is waiting for you. Hop to it. Dr. Peace, listen to my sounds.
Hello? The moment you step onto the field, the fight begins. If you win, you will be ranked ninth. If you lose, well, there's no need to go into that. Need to pop a breath mint? Hit the restroom? Brush your teeth? When you are ready, step inside. To be honest, your chances of survival are slim. But trust your force and head for the Garden of Madness.
Nice set of pipes you got there, old man. It has always been my dream to perform in a stadium such as this. A gentleman from the association told me I could have any stage I wanted today. How could I refuse such a kind offer? Tch. Courtesy of me and my entry fee, no doubt. My ex-wife called me the other day and I met my daughter for the first time in ten years. We dined at a fancy restaurant. One of those that are impossible to get a reservation for. And then afterwards, karaoke. Who got you the reservation? The association took care of it, of course. Fuck. My entry fee. What's important is not the fact the reservations are hard to get. In fact, no one gets reservations. The words reservations only apply only to those outside of the circle. It's getting into that circle that matters. And the food, good? Unfortunately, the atmosphere was a facade. Not once did my own daughter look me in the eye. Oh, the food tasted like blood. You're a junkie for blood, old man. Sadly, I can't disagree. There's only one way to live. People like us, we're sharks attracted to blood. You smelled blood too, didn't you? Isn't that why you're here? You got it, old man. And for some reason, I feel this sense of euphoria. Don't die on me too quickly. I want to gorge myself on this sense of fulfillment till I vomit. Man! This is what I live for! Fighting your own kind. Nothing's more gratifying! See you on the other side. Oh, oh, oh! Hey! Hey! 
Open mic night in hell, old man. Sing all you want down there.
Congratulations. You are now ranked number nine. What'd you expect? Wait a minute. Are you getting a little sentimental? Still green, aren't you? You know this is only the beginning. Call me when the next one's arranged. <laughs> 